This is DJ and Nintendo will be our oh, yeah. first match. It's gonna be a DK versus Ike, right? That's right. Yeah, man. Poop, Poop definitely putting in a uh, putting in work for the circuit right now in the, in the DK circuit. That's right. right. He's the he's the savior of DK. And you can check out the challenge link at challenge.com/guts3pmsingles. Uh, definitely check that out. Yeah. You can check out the bracket. We got a lot of killers here. We got uh, Emu Killer. <laughs> Emu Killer. Emu Killer. We got uh, man. This Reddit thread is not posting. All right, I'll do that later, I guess. So we're gonna get pretty hype right here. I got my man Apollo Ali joining me, and I'm uh, the very own TK Breezy. How's uh, it going, y'all? I've been doing a lot of work today, man. I was running the tournament too, man. It's really, but I mean, it's it's like second nature now, man. As, as much all this tournament experience you get from Xanadu, like for sure. This is my first time, you know, at a tournament where you're at. You yeah. did a lot of work, man. I was really yeah. impressed. You know, I've only seen you behind the mic, of course, but you're out here calling matches and stuff. That's really cool. Yeah, I think I only commented like four matches yesterday, though. But it was the top matches, so at least I'll get a lot of yeah, play. Yeah, sure, sure. I meant I needed to go do at least like two matches on Smash Bros. Two whenever she sets up. Yeah, hopefully that gets set up, set up. Yesterday we had a secondary stream at twitch.tv slash smashing rounds. Hopefully we'll get that up soon. And yeah, so I heard she's a. Uh, she just made it to the hotel about uh, 10 okay. minutes ago, so she okay. should be around soon. Yeah, Mizuki is our is our secondary streamer. Uh, Chibo is uh, always, as always putting in that work and doing this great stream. We have a great uh, Guts 3 overlay right now, the casino theme. Yeah, this is a great overlay. I mean, the music pack, too. I heard it's going out, so uh, go ahead and be on the lookout for that. But it looks like we're going to get to the first game right now. And a strong start right now from DJ Nintendo just oh, yeah. going straight uh, the, ham. The aggression. And Poob always goes for that punch right away, and DJ Nintendo is r ready right away to go in and punish that charge. And that's a priority for Poob a lot of times, you know, to get the punch because his punish game is so strong. Yeah, I mean, like, you, you get the you get the punch charged up, it's like almost an instant kill off uh, up throws and things oh, yeah. like that. So it seems like Poob's having a real hard time at least starting to get some damage. Finally got his first hit in there. Oh, all right. Pushing all right, nice. off stage, nice stuff. Well, nice pressure in this punish game, like I said, pretty strong. But DJ Nintendo is going to space him out too. And yeah, this is basically two very uh, space heavy characters. Uh, with, the, with the limbs, I mean, people think because he has limbs, like uh, his hitbox, are, you know, like they trade a lot, but a couple of his moves actually do have invincibilities in the arms, making right. them much like swords. So. Right, right. Ooh. These are two big boys right now. They're the big boys. Oh, yeah. I'm having a hard time uh, getting, this, getting this stock off right now. I mean, DJ Nintendo had a very strong start. Still got a pretty good uh, lead on the percentage, but. Uh, Oh, okay, nice stuff right there. Caught him jumping up and hits him with the four. They're gonna finish that stock. Yeah, he decided he went at really aggro and then decided to bait out that kill there. You know, he was like uh, covering the ledge with fairs and the like. Now I like that option DJ Nintendo just did right there. Um, with the when after he did the grab, he went for the quick draw. And uh, if Poop didn't tech, he would have got hit. And since he teched, he got the free jab. So nice little stuff right there. Cool frame traps coming up from DJ Nintendo. Well, like I said, Poop hasn't been able to get the punch at all, and he always has a punch. That's one of the things I always joke about with him is that. He always somehow finds a way to get a punch right, right away. There it right is. Right away. <laughs> so finally he got the breathing room to get it, and he taunts too, trying to trying to get get in the game. All right. So Poop now got the, uh, the pretty much the one hit, the one hit of quitter. But it does not matter right now. The quick spike from DJ Nintendo and no meteor. Ugh. I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and alleviate that. Nice stuff. Oh, went for the ramen noodles right there to try to get off stage, but uh, get hit. Poop still having a hard time getting in here though. Ooh, almost punished him there. Oh, all right, nice stuff right there. That'll be out of shield. It's really powerful. At a certain point, it starts actually setting him off stage. Ooh. I'm definitely liking the way DJ Nintendo is playing right now. Stage control seems to be all in his favor. Oh, yeah. He definitely has really strong stage control. Ooh. Oh, my God. He's got to put a spike of his own. <laughs> Let's go. Good stuff right there. Poop even it up yet again on stocks. It's a DI mix-up on that throw, actually, to set up the spike or the strong hit. Right. right? You can choose, basically. If you DI wrong, you get spiked. Yeah, I see a lot of DKs do that. Like, they cargo throw, and then they'll turn around two times and then yep. throw you. Oh, Ooh, wow. He wow. wanted that punch real bad. That would have... Yeah. A little thirsty for the punch right there, definitely. Yeah. He's got to conserve those, too, because DJ Nintendo's not going to let him get it, get it again. Ooh. Good hedgehog. Hey, yeah, caught him off that jump right there. Had immediately upbeat. Just had to grab that ledge. That was it. Poop. Poop now. Poop not out of this by any means, though. 74% on uh, uh, Ike as DK. It's a good percentage for him right now. Yeah, absolutely. He needs to get a, he's going to try to fish for the grab, and I think Nintendo, DJ Nintendo will know that. Ooh. All right, oh my wow. God. So much sword. DJ Nintendo scouted both of those jumps right there. Good stuff. Guys over here trying to figure out who, uh, what to do to get in right now. DJ Nintendo just jumping in with a huge sword. Yeah, his approaches are really messing him up right now. Ooh. Right, I thought he was going to go for that uh, offstage fair, but he decided <laughs> to 
It's like, you know, not, not worth it. Oh my god. Great shield pressure right there. <laughs> <laughs> the simple stuff. Uh, okay, he still makes it. Oh, oh, such a good back air. Reverse hitbox, too. Yeah, man, DJ of taking that to two stock easy. Yeah, looking strong there. And Puba, you know, it's funny because, like, everyone just talks about how hype he is or whatever. He's a yeah. really smart player. He yeah. really thinks about it. You talk to him, and he'll, he'll think and meditate on the match, like, what he did wrong, and he's going to try to improve. So I'm sure he's, there's a lot of thoughts going through his head right now about how to, how to you know, try to not get so overwhelmed by Nintendo's spacing and pressure. He didn't get, it like, a single punch at that, at that, uh, no, that match. I mean, uh, he also didn't charge him too much outside of the times he got to the KOs. But I understand, like, every time he had started, you didn't would just run over there with that uh that four I mean the fair just to you know get yeah, him that, out of it. That so. defensive like run back and yeah. forth and then as soon as he saw the punch he'd hit him with the sword. So. It really scared Poob out of doing charging that punch. Oh. Yeah, so unfortunate for uh for Poob right there. I mean see if he can uh it, oh alright, so he takes it right back. See if he can go ahead and try to uh, incorporate the punch a little better in his uh, gameplay since you uh guys like said that is one of his staples. He definitely likes this stage. Guts 3. Once again, guys, if you're trying to see the bracket, it is Guts 3 Project M Singles. Challenge.com. I think on deck we'll have Spaz versus Zero. If we can find Zero. <laughs> yeah. I don't, know what, I don't know. That man just disappeared. We saw him and then he left. And you saw right there, oh, Poop, Poop approached with and charged the punch and then, then did an aerial. So he found a way to get a little bit of a charge off in the intro as opposed to getting punished right away. Yeah, for those who don't, don't, don't know, you don't have to charge the whole punch the entire way of when you start. You can uh, cancel it with By a couple of swings right? stuff. Yeah. And uh, uh, actually, a 9 punch uh, is stronger than a, a 10 punch with that, the amount of swings you get to max it out. But the 10 punch has. Um, Invincibility. Super, uh, yeah, armor. I don't think it's super armor anymore, but I know it's armor. I think oh, I, 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 Poop told me it was invincibility. Oh, invincibility. Yeah. Okay. That's hype. <laughs> I could be wrong, but that's that's what I remember him telling me. Cool. Nice ball to get up out of there real quick. Nintendo, uh, yet again, with a pretty good Looking lead. strong even at the ledge. Yeah. Didn't, not, didn't let that phase him at all. Space dot Poop. And there's that punch in the reverse hitbox. Unlucky for DJ Nintendo. Nice stuff right there. Poop. Poop. People out of Poop. Audience is yelling. Got a little bit of audience right now. But as he should, you know, uh, a, a uh, New England native. So. Ooh, nice yeah. stuff. And he's a new PM player, too. You know, he didn't really go to tournaments until uh, we started Smashing Grounds. Oh, okay. He was a, a Wi Fi player, <laughs> not even Netplay. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, uh, DJ Nintendo covering those options. Yeah, that coverage there. is so good. Oh, oh, oh cover, okay. Who was trying to disrespect right there? <laughs> Just real quick. Oh, no. I don't know if I agree with that idea of going down below the ledge. Oh, man. Just barely managed to make it back. All right. So, Poop can at least Ooh. put some. Oh, okay. Got him on stage. Oh, oh what a gimp. Nice stuff, right? Poop. Poop, though. The audience wild right now for Poop. <laughs> Anytime he does anything, it's Poop stuff, man. <laughs> Oh, good back air, really good back air. He did Nintendo's patience, man. He always chooses such good spacing options. And he looks right. so good on those platforms. Oh, too. yeah. He covers them so well. I mean, uh, just uh, Ike in general just has really good hitboxes sure. come through or, I mean, like, above and under. So that neutral air just swipes the whole under him right now. Good stuff right here. Just adding damage. In. Wow. Trying to disrespect himself. Like, <laughs> guys, just calm down. He's breathing. <laughs> He wants them to be going, DJ, in the <laughs> audience. He's not having that poop stuff. All right. Once again, uh, he had the lead for a little bit off that uh, really good uh, stay, uh, lead hog, but he seems to have not been able to uh, get that damage in after since then. Okay. Again, that shield pressure, but a good buffered roll by DJ Nintendo that time. He didn't fall for it. That's what I don't see poop doing a lot, is uh, actually dash attacks. Yeah, and that's why he probably... Oh. Pick the stage. Okay. Well, that was unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. Might be the nerves. Yeah, I hope, yeah. I hope that doesn't flush them too much. I mean, you're down, but you're not out. Uh, nice stuff. Get. Oh, okay. I, I like that stuff right there. My uh, poop definitely got a couple mix ups in there. Ooh. Yeah, he's a clutch player. He's into the combine, so I'm not surprised that he's turning it up right now. And that will take the stock. <laughs> that, was, that was the weirdest oh of mix ups right there. Like, he jumped up, and I guess he started DIing for like a forward or back throw, and he just threw him straight up. Like, watch this. Yeah, the up air is so we weirdly powerful. You don't think it's going to kill because it's a combo move, too. Yeah. But it actually does kill off of up throw really easily on a stage like this. Okay. We'll make it back to the ledge. Oh, oh never mind. Nice that, sweep right there, by, and that's going to be it. Great stuff. Nicely done by DJ Nintendo.
He really had a lot of strengths, like in controlling the pace of that match. Oh yeah, that was a great, that was a great fourth throw. Down angle so he can catch some hands real quick. All right, I'm I'm gonna take a moment and try to post this Reddit thread. It's telling me I don't have.